Pow with another video. This is big for tomorrow and why this is big because we need to be watching the spy. I'll go over the spy. I'm also going to go over IWM. I'm also going to go over QQQ because these are the big ballers right now in the market. We also have some earnings tomorrow that I want you guys to be watching out for because they're going to be moving the market also. So stay tuned for it. Smash the like button. Subscribe if you're new. Smash that like button. Let's get the video over 100 likes. Now, we have two videos already posted. I got a video on Mullen, IMPP, AMP stock, NEO. That's all in this video here. So if you want levels on Mullen or IMPP, NEO or AIP, it's in this video, right? Same levels. Then I got video on a penny stock. This is a penny stock video, okay? Just to give you a hint, ATXI, skills, rig, and much more. So make sure you go watch that video, right? So two videos for this. Make sure you go check it out. Subscribe. We're almost over that 25K mark. And Instagram, will.knowledge. The link is right there too, okay? So let's go ahead and get into it. SPY, key, 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 very important levels. You need to be watching out for the SPY. I would say the main level is this resistance level at 383. Why is that? Because if the SPY, wherever the SPY is right now, right, it could pull down to the buying level that I'm going to give you guys. It could pull down to the support level. But what's big is what does it do at this resistance level, okay? Does it bust through it? Does it act as support and go higher? What would show a lot of strength and this right here? Or this, if it breaks through it with a lot of strength, or if it holds this resistance level as a support at 383, I think we're going all the way up here to 400, okay? Now, with that being said, I'll probably get bigger call options, trade to the upside. Like I told you guys, potential reversal coming. We might be starting to see something like this because SPY kind of traded sideways and didn't really go anywhere a whole month. This is September 23rd, and we're finally starting to break out of there, right? So I tried to tell you guys this beforehand. This is very big for tomorrow, hence the title. So we might be seeing a reversal like this. So get prepared. But we also could see a short-lived reversal, something like this. So we don't know how far it's going to go. That's why you need to watch this resistance level at 383. Now, we have a buying level at 376. I already have call options. Um, we sold some of those call options for about a 70% gain. Still holding those. So looking for about 100% gain on those call options. But I'm also looking to buy more of those call options. Now, why is that? Because... At this 383 level, if we blow through that or if it holds support, I'm going to get more call options to trade up to 400. We have a buying level right here at 376. So I'm looking for a little pull down. That's when I'm looking to load up on more call options to trade to the upside because I already have some. So I'm in no rush to try to get them, especially in this type of market. You want to watch that. But then we have a support down here at 370. If this support starts to break, we're probably going to go back down to the what? The downside okay so very very important levels you need to be watching out for tomorrow tomorrow is going to tell us a lot okay so just make sure you're on the team first thing in that description join the team you get all my buys and sales you learn how i find these levels how do i find support levels entry levels exit levels it puts the youtube videos all together so now you know what i'm looking at how i'm finding them what i'm looking at and it just makes it more easier okay so make sure you join the team you can pay for the yearly you get two months free when you pay for the year we have the monthly prices go up november 1st Prices are going to continue to go up, so you might as well get in while it's the cheapest, okay? Well, it's not the cheapest, but why it's lower, okay? Join private live stream of buys and sells. I'll also teach you guys how to trade. So if you're watching the video, I'm pretty sure you want to learn how to trade, build that knowledge, build your skills, first link. Now, that's SPY. Let's go to IWM, because like I said, all these are important, but the big earnings you should be watching out for tomorrow, they come pre-market, okay? They come out pre-market. One is 3M. And then I want you guys to be watching UPS down here, right? So UPS is going to be a big one. UPS is going to move a lot. It's also going to have sympathies off FedEx. UPS is going to tell us about shipping and all this stuff. So this is a big one. You want to be watching out for what they say, especially their earnings call. So I'm going to listen to their earnings call. I'm going to see what they're talking about because this is a big one. We want to know that. So watch out for UPS. So IWM. Key levels on IWM. It hit that resistance level at one. Let me take these off real quick. So I had a resistance level at 176. Let me see. It hit that resistance level three times, and it hasn't broke through there yet. So this is our first sign that um, IWM wants to start pushing up higher. Right now, SPY is looking more to the heavy side than IWM, but then that could lead to potential gains on IWM. So watch the 376. And then a level that I'm looking at is literally where price is. I'm going to say around 173. Is a buying pressure level in IWM. So any type of pullback tomorrow in IWM, I'll be looking around 173. The price is around 173.44, so it's not too far from that 173 level. Watch that because if it pulls down and we get buying pressure, I'll probably get call options on that to trade us up to around 176 to 178. 
And then if we actually break through the resistance level with a lot of pressure, we're probably going to go up to 186. Okay, so watch out for that. Like I said, this will be the signs of a bigger reversal coming. So watch that. 176 is a big resistance level. And then on QQQ, we have we, we have to watch um, 280. But more importantly, I want you guys to watch around 284. So I'm going to move it up some more. Move it up to about 284. Right now, SPY is looking the strongest right now, pushing. But that leads to more opportunities to these other ones, right? Because they're not pushing yet, which they might. So let me take all this off. So 284, that's a big key level we need to be watching for on, oh, my bad. That's the key level we need to be watching for on the SPY. I mean, QQQ. And then I'll probably be looking at around 276 if we get pullback to enter on um, some call options on QQQ. Like I said, I trade the upside and I trade the downside. So just make sure you join the team so you're prepared with me. Because when this market actually turns bullish, when I'm 100% bullish in the market, we will be loading the boat. We will be buying stuff like crazy. You want to be make sure you're ready for that. Okay, I'm telling you now. You want to make sure you're ready for that. And December 31st, I'm actually closing it to new members. You won't be able to join probably for like a good month. I'm telling you now. Okay, the price will go up November 1st. So thank you guys for watching the video. Always remember, no circuit based to the bar. So anything just for education purposes only. So do not trade anything you see or hear in the video. I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye.